So I found a faster way using the Venture Resolve AI tool to create them for me, tweak them. And I'm glad we did because the movie ended up being selected in some international film festival. Let me show you how you can do it. Today I would like to show you how to add AI generated subtitle inside the Venture Resolve. For this example, I'll be using a short film that I had the privilege to work on as a cinematographer and video editor. We have survived from torture, persecution, and racism. The trauma of these painful experiences make it hard for us to tell our story. But we have decided to raise our voice. The director of the film is Lorenzo Rani, who is a filmmaker based in London. He tells the stories of young migrants forced to find new home. When we finished the production of this film, we wanted to create some subtitles for festival submission and wider audiences. But creating them manually is time consuming and I didn't want to spend too much time on it. So I found a faster way using the Venture Resolve AI tool to create them for me, tweak them. And I'm glad we did because the movie ended up being selected in some international film festival. Let me show you how you can do it. All right, guys, as you can see, we are inside the Venture Resolve and I have my file already imported into the software. I just drag it to the timeline. Let's extend the audio for visibility and I like to see the thumbnail view on my timeline as well. Perfect. So once you've done that, let's play the video. We also had a sweet home. We had our family around and used to eat our traditional foods. As I said, no subtitle. So now let's create the subtitle. Pretty simple. Go to timeline, AI tool, and create subtitle from audio. Let's keep it to auto for the language. I like the Netflix um, type of writing and I just want a single line. Hit create. It will just take a few seconds. It's very fast. And boom, all the captions have been created. A new track has been created as well called subtitle number one. As you can see, they are in white as I scroll through the video right now. Now let's play a bit. We also had a sweet home. We had our family around and used to eat our traditional foods. Perfect. Let's look for another point to play to just see. It's not illegal to choose peace over war, hope over fear. So now we will look how to customize the subtitle that we've created. So we click on the inspector on the right side of the frame of the software, sorry. And we have all the captions that have been created for the film. Let's say I want to fix this. I don't want the soft music. And then you just click it and delete it. Let's go to track. I want to change the color of the subtitle to yellow. This is what we did for the actual short film. And now also I want to change the size of it. I think 50 is pretty good. I don't want it to be too big, but not too small as well. And we can just uh, change the position of the Y axis to not cover the face because, you know, the face is everything, the eyes is everything when you're telling a story. Now everything has been applied to the timeline. Perfect. And uh, what you can do also, you can fix any errors that the AI might have made. As you can see, there is a number 34 here in red. That means the subtitle goes too fast. We are young refugees and asylum seekers. And it's very easy to fix that. You can just drag it and extend it to the point that you wish for, as you can see. And you bring back the other one. That's why I like to use the waveform. Let's play it and see how it goes now. We are young refugees and asylum seekers, and we have a lot to offer. Perfect. Now you see, it's pretty easy. So let's go to delivered because I don't want to keep it too long, guys. And uh, yeah, you export your video if you hit play. Now you have the subtitle burn into your video. We have survived from torture, persecution, and racism. 
The trauma of these painful experiences make it hard for us to tell our story. But we have decided to raise our voice. So this is how you can create subtitle for your film inside DaVinci Resolve. That's all I have for you guys today. Peace be upon you. Until next time.